across the region, people spent the day and night digging out. Plows, snowblowers, shovels, whatever it took to get the job done. Some areas are left with feet of snow. It's safe to say that some will be dealing with the aftermath of this storm for days to come. We have team coverage of the cleanup. Let's start with Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Davis in South Philadelphia. And Kim, the city lifted the snow emergency, but the backbreaking work to clear that snow continues. Jess, that's right, and folks out here wanted to get a head start on all of this snow before the temperatures started to drop. As you can see, it is snowing once again here in South Philadelphia, but we spotted some residents who were willing to lend a helping hand to their neighbors as well as their loved ones. This isn't the first day Michael Jamie has been digging South Philly out. In fact, it's the third. He wanted to get a head start on what was to come to clear not only his own sidewalk, but his neighbors too. There's a lot of elderly people on the block, so what I try to do is lend a hand. I'm not looking for nothing. He even considers the trash collectors when shoveling the block. I'm kind of like, suit for this, let's go, let's rock. Come on, Mother Nature, let's do it. Michael has lived in his South Philly neighborhood for 20 years, and snow days are something he takes pride in. It's one of the best things in life. Snow days, you get to shovel, get to exercise, get out, breathe some air. And some were just doing their responsibility as a son for a mother who happened to be snowed in. I was supposed to come yesterday, but I was at work all yesterday, and she just asked me to come shovel, which is always she usually does. So. I mean, I came straight from work to travel for. It doesn't cost anything to be kind. And in the city of brotherly love and sisterly affection, kindness can come in many forms, including that of a shovel. That's what it's about, the people. We all got to come together with all the crazy going on. We have to show that love for Philly is love for Philly. That's right. And trash and recycling collection will resume tomorrow. But residents should expect delays as crews try to navigate through these road conditions. We're live in South Philly this evening. I'm Kimberly Davis, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. I love it. Positive attitude goes a long way. Kimberly, thank you.